calm day. We're going into the city. We now have Luke with us, our second companion. Him and Emilio are probably gonna go see the nightlife here in Amsterdam. But I'm gonna stay back and stay home for today. Kind of make it a quick one. This is just too wonderful. I just would like to stay here forever. It's the same quiet neighborhood that we were in before. Only is hitting 10 times harder than it did yesterday. Lifestyle. I'm out. So it's 8.05. I have to be on the inner city train, the Euro train at 9.10. I don't know. Actually, no, I will make it. I will make it. I got all my stuff with me. I really don't know how this is gonna end, but it's gonna end well. I'm, I'm wishing and hoping for that. I'm very excited. I'm stoked. I'm just, I just had my last breakfast with, with Thea. She was wonderful. She taught me a lot that my parents, my parents and like the people closest to me would never teach me since, you know, they're very uh, specific people, very specific to what they can teach me. But it's all about uh, getting to meet newer people, new people every day and uh, seeing what they can do for you as you can do for them. I'm really happy that uh, I'm leaving here, going somewhere else. I can't get too comfortable. It'll be too much for me. Because once I get comfortable, there's just no, there's nothing after that. There's no more love. There's no more uh, caretaking. It's just uh, a constant loop of a flow. We'll pick back up whenever I'm at the station. Confusing. Confusing, confusing, confusing. Why does it say Paris? A banana? Um, can I have a sneakers? Do you take cash? No, thank you. Quit walking. Look at him go, look at him go. <laughs> this shit's amazing, this shit's amazing. Yeah, this is, this is beautiful. But let's get on this fucking train before we fucking miss this shit. I mean, we gotta fucking walk there. It'll be like a fucking 28 hour walk. This is never fucking ending, bro. It just keeps on going. It doesn't stop, bro. It's the biggest fucking train in, in, in the entire world. We're now switching trains. We're switching carts. Because it's so hot in here. Everyone's leaving. This is a good thing because this means everyone that reserved a seat won't have the reserve seat because they're leaving it. I don't have a reserve seat, so people are going to kick me out, but now they won't. I now have the best seat on the train. I'm in the same train cart, but here in the front, everyone left it. It's not even that bad. There's two windows open, one right there, one right there. So it's a little cooler because it feels good outside. You don't get luckier than this. This is it right here. I just gotta be careful with my stuff because there's a lot of pickpocketers on the trains. I'm not trying to have my stuff taken. I feel a bit unsafe right now. I don't know whether this is a good area or a bad area. I have. I have no idea, but we're just gonna head to the hostel as, as soon as we can. This is kind of weird. I don't know. Yeah, this is just, it's crazy. I always have to like, look behind me because it doesn't seem safe, but I guess it is like one of the safest cities. It's just really big, so many people. I don't know who to trust. <sighs> just be careful out there, but we'll make it there in six minutes. We'll make it.
So I will be sharing a room with one, two, three, four, five different people that I've never met before. We're gonna see how this goes. So I don't think I'm feeling this hostile room. Uh, instead of Berlin, I might just take a trip to Prague. Like right now, after being on the train for six hours, I still would like to be somewhere else. I'll probably just have to sleep on it and just leave tomorrow morning. That's when I check out. So uh, I'm waiting for the guys to get here though, because I got here first. Um, and I have to give them the key, I have to give them the bedding and everything. I'm not sure what to do. I think I just have to sleep it through the night because I'm exhausted. And uh, yeah, I just, I guess I just have to wait for tomorrow morning. I wake up super early. I don't even want to shower. The toilet is clogged. Um, the shower just looks dirty. Like it doesn't, like I don't feel, I just don't feel good showering here. I love how this trip has this to offer me, um, but I can make something good out of it. And maybe I can get some rest uh, not wash my clothes yet. I have a lot of dirty clothes and I need to wash really fast. I don't have any socks anymore. I don't have any underwear. I'm in, I'm on an in and out underwear right now. So I should, I should sleep it through the night. And tomorrow when we arrive to Prague, I will clean everything and just take a shower and freshen up. I think that's the move. Yeah, I'll see you then.